Hey guys, so it's Vlogmas Day 15. Callie. Wigglebot. Hey. Hey. Happy Vlogmas Day 15. We only got 10 days left after this. How scary is that? Hi. That's really for all of you. She just wants to kiss everyone's nose. Mwah. <laughs> So, yes, I think she literally just did she? Yep. <laughs> she just fogged up the camera. But, yes, I am eating some lunch, have my ramen, watching YouTube, as always. I have 50 pages left of Eleanor and Park, so I'm going to finish this. I'm very excited. I really like this, too. So then all I'll need to read from my role is Attachments. Which is pretty awesome, because I've, like, power-read her books in the last month, pretty much. Like, I I read Landline a couple months ago, and I rated that four stars. But then I just read Fangirl, and then Carry On, and then Eleanor and Park, right, one right after the other. And they're all pretty much five-star reads for me. So that's awesome. And then I'm going to work on Clockwork Angel. I want to get this finished. Um, at this point, I've thrown all my library books aside because I can renew all of them, so I'll work on those in January. And I just want to kind of focus on the Shadowhunters books. Um, see if I can finish those. And, like, I'll be fine if I'm on Clockwork Princess and City of Heavenly Fire when the show comes on because I don't think they're going to get that far in the first season, I think they're going to do, the, like, the first two books, I think. Is what my impression is from the casting, is that they have the first two books planned. I don't know for sure, but I think it's only the first two. I don't know. We'll find out. I could easily figure this out, because all I would have to see is if they, uh, cast Sebastian. But I'm not looking right now. I think that's his name, isn't it? Yeah, Sebastian. But I don't know. I'm not going to look right now and figure that all out. Hello, glare from my mirror. That's really weird. Never had that happen. That's weird. There, that stopped. <laughs> Yes, I have Majora's Mask, like, window cleans on my mirror over there. I like them. But yes, Callie, are you happy it's almost Christmas time? It's ten days till Christmas. Is that crazy? Yes. Callie's getting all the spoiled this year. I honestly don't think... I used to have two other dogs uh, when I was younger, like, a lot younger. Uh, we had to get rid of them just before high school because we moved into an apartment. My old apartment that you guys have never seen because I didn't start my channel until we moved here. Um, but, yeah. We moved into our old apartment so we had to get rid of my dogs. But I don't think we ever, like truly got them Christmas presents. I think maybe we would give them, like, a bone or something. Her, I actually do not allow to have bones. Like, she can have the, um, the small marrow bones every once in a while, but they are a very, very special treat for her. But my old dogs never really had toys. They were outdoor dogs. So they never really had toys, um, or, like, the, the treats I give her. So, their tree was bones. But, yeah. Callie's spoiled rotten. She's my little baby. Because another big thing is that I, like, wasn't even supposed to have her. Um, my aunt, before she passed away, even though we had Bella upstairs, had told me that I was not allowed to get a dog. That Bella was a special circumstance and that I was not, you know, no, no pets. Um... She passed away in February, and, um, I had just decided that I was gonna, 
I was going to ask my parents. I had been asking them for years for a pet because I knew at my old place if I had asked my landlord I could probably get a cat because she had cats downstairs. So my old landlord might have let me get a cat. So I've been begging my parents for years to get a pet and I finally managed to convince my mom just to go look at the pound. Um, but then the circumstance happened where Callie was available and there was just no going back. As soon as my mom came home and was like, how do you feel about a Cocker Spaniel? There was just no way I was getting her. So she's been a little special girl. I'm excited. It's her first Christmas with us. And honestly, the way she's reacting to... Christmas decorations in general, I feel like she's never seen them before. I really feel like they never decorated over at the old house, and she's never seen Christmas decorations. She's never, we know she wasn't, you know, we know she never got treats or anything, so it sucks, but she's going to be scared as shit when the wrapping paper comes out. I was wrapping my godkids presents the other day and she was scared. So, gonna love how she, she reacts to opening her presents. But this video is gone on not enough, so I'm going to get going and upload this. Uh, I hope you guys all have an awesome day and I'll see you tomorrow for day 16. Bye everyone!